I play a little bit. Do you? I could check your left hand. I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to deny it. <laughs> the first time I picked up a basketball, I was seven years old. And there was a basketball that the prior occupants of the house had left in my home. And we happened to move into a home right next to a park. And so I feel like I've been chasing a basketball since that time. One, two, one, two, one, two. I like to say my career in broadcasting was a very happy accident because I had no intention of being a broadcaster. In fact, if you could have seen me in college, you would find the notion that I am a broadcaster laughable. I had it all going on. Bad hair, bad teeth, bad clothes, and the only thing I cared about was whether my jump shot would ever match my dribble drive ability. Greg Popovich, difficult start. What'd you see? Well, we, we didn't score. I think it's in my best interest, Mike, to leave it at that. Mike. I basically fell into this broadcasting thing. Ilya Sova almost turned it over and uh... You know, we are in a hazardous area here courtside as Doris Burke, a good set of hands. You got to give DB a lot of credit, hustling back from talking with the coaches. Look at the handle. She's as versatile as anybody who broadcasts basketball now. Now it's center court for the presentation of the Larry O'Brien Trophy. Please welcome ABC's Doris Burke. I think Doris has hit the trifecta in her career. She loves her job. She's great at her job. Everybody that works with her loves her. I don't think it gets any better than that. My inspiration is Doris. Uh, I think she's a stunning woman. I don't know, dinner at my house anytime, as long as she comes alone, you know? <laughs> she's absolutely the LeBron James of ESPN NBA broadcasting. Cleveland! This is for you! I'm trying to make every broadcast the best I can possibly make it. That's my goal, every night.